and welcome to the show. We are here today on Forza Horizon 5 with some more of our kind of multiplayer races. For this one, we were to go, or we are to go racing, with some B-Class Volvo 242 Turbo. So it's kind of a one-make race, however, you could choose how to build this car up to B-Class. And there was no rules about the build. I've got all-wheel drive, 3.2 straight 6, and off-road race tyres. I have no idea if this is a good call or not. We've got some 300 horsepower, it's a little bit lighter than it was to start with. Um... Yeah, this is a mixed surface event, so it should be very good off-road. I don't know how many people are going to have gone off-road race tyres, how many people have swapped the cars. Uh, we will find out as things go as on. We started as a fairly technical circuit, so this will not really be the track for me. Um, if anybody's braved... I did think of going the semi-slick route. Uh, I do tend to... I have liked that route. It's tended to work for me so far in, in Horizon. Um... Or even you go all the way for full slicks if you want. You wouldn't get much power, but you'd have so much grip. Uh, yeah, somebody probably will have done that. We will have to wait and see, though. We are off the line fairly nicely. There are definitely more powerful cars out there than me. Now, I mean, we normally... I'm kind of working on the basis that we're probably going to have... The majority either going to be crazy grip, like slicks, or uh, some sort of rally. You could go for something completely different. Um, I haven't seen many builds make it work, um, but you could definitely contemplate going for uh, standard, or not, maybe not standard tyres here, but uh, yeah, some lesser grade tyre, get some power in your car. Who knows whether it would work or not, but uh, Longbow's got an overlap there. We'll give some space there. Oh, we're going to get... It's just, we're going to get boxed in. There are many, many bricks between us and first. <laughs> it's just the battle of the bricks is going on. Uh, I do not have the straight line speed. So we're a curious car. Um, of course, these off-road race tyres are not, not too bad in the corners in B-Class. I've yeah, got a good chunk of grip. I don't have the straight line speed of a bunch of cars. I'll speed beast. So he's got into trouble going through there, and Paul Longbow was the one that actually ended up coming out worse of all of that. I uh, got stuck in the kind of traffic, if you like. Uh, we've kind of been stuck in traffic a little bit here too. Can we try and sneak up the inside of the red Volvo here? Desperately trying, but to no avail. Although we've got another good run down here. Uh, not really going to... No, this corner here is so difficult to overtake in. However, we can be fast through. Nope. Not quite going to get ourselves into the right place to have a sneaky look here, although we might on the exit as they slide. So I'm going to guess that's a rear-wheel drive one that we are currently battling with. Um, we're not going to get... Oh, I wanted to duck underneath. <laughs> Cruiser did a good job of covering that. Longbow's found a gap through the middle. I was trying to cut back underneath and I just mistimed it. I'm trying to block Longbow in so that they're stuck, but uh, I haven't got the straight-line speed to really make that one work. Speed Beast with a lot more straight line speed than all of us tries and then has to lift because we got to a corner all of a sudden. I uh, don't know how fast we can be here with our varying levels of grip, but we will take back those two places we lost <laughs> and put ourselves into fourth. Can I chase after third place? That is the question here. I'm going to give it a try. Uh, the answer is we're pretty good through that sort of turn one section we made a gap to Longbow which was needed um, and then oh, don't get into trouble through here I wonder if and the cars around me look like that don't miss that check I've missed that one before the cars around me look like they're rear wheel drive we're going to lose out to Longbow because I completely butchered that section um, they look like they're rear wheel drive by the amount they're sliding I mean I don't know necessarily if they are uh, we're not really sliding at all in this. We've got big, chunky tyres uh, that don't really slide around. We haven't really got the power either. 300 horsepower all-wheel drive is not really enough to have the car sliding about. Um, well, certainly on power delivery. Can I be quick through here again? We are. We're, <laughs> we're quick, but we're not quick enough. We're not close enough to have a look. We know Longbow's got some speed in that car through some of these corners. We're trying to say, I mean, we've been quite good through this section, oddly. Longbow's going to get a little bit stacked up here. Maybe. This could be, ah, no. Not quite, got, not quite got the gears in the right place there uh, for me. Longbow's thinking and wanting to have a look up the inside. He's going to try. However, you're going to immediately 
have the other car fight back. This is the last spot on the podium here. I think Lombo's going to finally get this move done. Uh, to the inside. We're going to try. I wanted to try and follow, but there wasn't quite. I wasn't quite close enough to make that one stick. Uh, we're going to have one lap to try and get fourth, really. Uh, I think that's the best as we're going to get here, unless anything goes on. We haven't quite got the pace of Longbow's car. We're quick in a couple of corners, but over the course of the lap, which is not quite fast enough. And we are very good through that final section. That will bright me up into a fourth position. But yeah, don't quite know where we're going to be able to carry enough speed. Longbow does run wide and brushes the wall up ahead. However, we are not going to be close enough here, and that's going to pull away. Uh, I mean, don't do anything dumb is kind of... I want to be close enough so that if Lombard does make a mistake, we can capitalise. However, I also don't want to do... don't want to go miss a checkpoint while being... like, pushing too hard to catch a car that's not really likely. Like, miss, missing a checkpoint and throwing away a fourth, chasing a car that I just don't quite have the pace to to beat is a bit silly, so yeah, we're not going to do that I think we're going to have to just settle for the fourth, I mean, okay, our car is off-road race tyres um, it's not it's certainly not a bad handling vehicle here we will see how it does when it gets to the dirt, but it's a solid start it's a solid enough start for the one make race kind of one make race yeah, we will cross the line, it will be in a uh, in a fourth place. It was a good battle. We had a good fight in the kind of mid-pack for a while of that. Don't have the pace of the top two there. Uh, not even close to uh, to that. Long way a little faster. Um, yeah, we're, <laughs> we're off the pace a bit. But uh, the important thing is we did have at least an entertaining race in all of that one. We head to the Baja circuit for our next race. I should be pretty good here. Uh, this should be as good as it really gets for my car at the, <laughs> at the end of the day. We have the all-wheel drive, we have the big tyres. Um, should hopefully do well. We are starting a bit further back. Uh, we'll see what we can do, really, with our, uh, with our Volvo. Um, I hope I can get off the line clean. We can stay out of trouble. If we can make us some places, well, you know, kind of sneak the ghost mode a little bit. I wish I still to this day wish I could turn it off. <laughs> I don't really like. I understand it for you know public lobby stuff, sure, but still rather not. It always feels a little bit cheap, basically. I mean, I'll do it because I mean I've got to make the most of it, really. But uh, I, say I will make the most of it. But it's, yeah, it's, it will always feel a bit cheap. However, um, yeah, we'll see what we can do. We don't a lack of straight line speed is a little smidge of a problem. I say a smidge of a problem, I mean, I was I'm kind of surprised by a slight lack of straight line speed in relative terms to everything else. So, off-road race tyres, normally, maybe it's the weight, I wonder if that is what's done me a smidge here. Off-road race tyres don't up the PI by as much as uh, let's say the rally tyres, for example. So normally the off-road race tyre vehicle would have more power, be faster for a straight line than a rally tyre vehicle, for example. It's worse on tarmac, but uh, the only thing I can think of for me here is that I did go weight reduction rather than power, so maybe that's what's hurting me, although weight reduction is good for acceleration. It should be, it should be good off the line, and we're not great there either. I don't know. It's always curious to see how, you know, everyone here has got the same. Maybe, maybe the engine wasn't a good call, actually, the 3.2 straight 6. Maybe I'll be better off with a different engine. But that is also a possibility. Whether the standard engine would have been the way to go, I don't know. I went for the straight 6. Um, I think it's lighter than the standard setup, perhaps? No, actually, not completely sure. Yeah, or maybe the engine swap was a bad call in this one. Can we go around the outside of Longbow up here? No, we might be able to duck underneath though for the exit. We've got a good run here. Uh, the leader is not far away. We're all over the back of Longbow's Volvo here. <laughs> we try to get to the inside, not going to cut it. Everyone goes to avoid the water there. We are... Oh! 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 I'm annoyed at myself. 
We just got this. We did the stupid snag bumpers and kind of got the cars stuck together a little bit. Ah, god damn it. We are on for a really good race there. And, yeah. I was trying to be, I was trying to be a little bit sneaky and just got the car a little bit stuck, basically. I'm really annoyed by that. We had a chance to win this one and it has all gotten away from us. Don't know where we might be able to climb to by the end of this. Probably not have enough time to do much. Ah! <laughs> Well, you know, it happens sometimes. Don't miss a checkpoint down here. This is what I was saying in the first race about the don't miss a checkpoint unnecessarily. I mean, that one there, we were in the fight for position at least. Uh, yeah, it's just a dumb, dumb, annoying little mistake to make. Now we've got to try and find a way. Oh, now we've got to try and find a way past the cars that are struggling a lot more for grip than we are. We've got to scythe around there. That puts us up in to seven. Okay, can we chase down? Fifth is it a million miles away? If we can, but we're going to have to be really quick. Uh, everyone is taking to this. Oh, no, Lombo's done the same thing, maybe. Lombo has missed the checkpoint as well. <laughs> we shall resume our battle. Sadly, we're not battling for the second place there. Uh, we are now battling over what might be fifth maybe four. Depends on how fast Proto's car is out here. Um, yeah, well, <laughs> mistakes were made at the Baja circuit, it seems. I don't know whether that line... I kind of like that line, but I don't think it's the best way through that corner, to be honest with you. Uh, Longwell has got a little more straight line speed than I do. Yeah, out wide. Yeah, although Longwell's car is bouncing horribly across these uh, bumps. That car isn't actually too bad over the bumps there. We're now going to try and duck underneath Oh, this is going to be a really tight line in an awkward place. I don't actually want to be... Oh, no, we've got a great landing, surprisingly. We can fire up the inside here, stop the car on the apex, try and prevent somebody from fighting back. Uh, let's get some drive in the Volvo, and maybe we can chase after four by the end of the race. In fact, Lombo is still fighting there, so you know, we've got... Now, I'm on off-road suspension on my car, uh, I wonder if others have got the different suspension because we are riding the bunch better than quite a few of these things that we're seeing. So, and I haven't tuned the suspension. It's all, that, that double pass was done because I landed the jump better. I landed the jump better, carried speed, uh, and yeah, just kind of went. Whereas Combo's car bobbled horribly. We're going to fire up the inside into the final corner. Oh, we're going to overshoot a little bit on the exit. We had to try something there. We know we're going to be good across the bumps on the run to the line. Looks like we're going to actually outdrag Proto anyway. Uh, it was, yeah, silly error. Silly error by me. Uh, tangling. Drop Mr. Checkpoint. Don't know what happened to Longboat, but quite possibly a similar thing. Trying to battle for the lead there. Dropped us back. We ended up having a kind of rematch of that battle further back. I climbed back up to fourth in the end of all that. Um, it was a fun... I'm annoyed at the mistake. We did still at least have a fairly fun race. Yeah, Speed is, is half decent. Uh, oh well. <laughs> I'll take said I'll take a, a, an at least exciting kind of battle. That's something. We head next to the Emerald Circuit. I yeah, I, always, I like this one as far as tarmac circuits go. It's always an interesting one. Um, quite a fiddly circuit. I'm not going to be the worst here. I think my lack of straight line speed might be a smidge bit of a problem. We will... Again, we will see. I will do what I can with the car. We should have a good starting spot, at least. We should... <laughs> we should do okay for a bit. I suspect we'll probably drop back and we'll probably be in the sort of fourth, fifth place battle again. Uh, but... You never know. Maybe something will magically work in this car. It is at least half decent in the twisty stuff. Does it... Well, it gets off the line... Alright, it's certainly not got the pace of uh, the longbow machine, or, well, the Speed Beast car we saw uh, in that first race was very quick down the straights, but, oh god, it's going to be compromised somewhere else. Oh, it's going to be compromised somewhere else, it's going to be compromised, and then it's going to not be able to turn. My guess would be tyre compound in that one. Oop. Uh, I don't know what that might be running, but you might get away with it here. There are... 
There is this next section that is fiddly. This bit here is always tough uh, to get through if you've got a power car. We don't have a problem getting through it. Death Strike's a little bit boxed in here. Didn't really have anywhere to go, although I'm going to be on a really bad line through there. I thought I'd have the grip to hold that. I did not. Um, we're about to get past. Oh, uh, let's, uh, let's try and carry some speed. We're going to get boxed in ourselves here. It's going to be three wide towards the start finish line here. Uh, right. Okay, so Speedy's car is not too bad around here. It might be a handful in places. It's going to be. It's going to be one of those cars that, if, if doesn't make any mistakes, can be quite fast, but it is going to be difficult to keep it out of the wall and out of the rocks, because there are a couple of nasty places where you can get in trouble. Uh, Longbow's car looks fast as well, but at places I feel like my car's got a little bit more grip. Deathstrike is sliding a lot in that thing. It's got much smaller tyres uh, going on in that than uh, my one, that's for sure. Ah, I should know better than that. Oh, I hate, I, and I say it every time, I love this circuit, I hate the stones down there. I didn't even really think I was being that silly with the line I was taking there, but it's still just got a little bit too much to the inside. Around the final corner, I mean, we're not a million miles away from this group. When it gets to the twisty bits, we're not too bad if I don't hit the bloody stones. This is the bit that hurts us slightly. I mean, it is helpful that we're not locked in battle the whole way uh, through these corners, whereas the cars ahead are fighting. They are going to slow each other down. They're going to get held up by each other. Speedbeast will be trying to defend that third place. Deathstrike's looking for a way past. Oh, I thought Deathstrike's going to miss a checkpoint there. Good good pass. Very good pass. Uh, Speedbeast will, will struggle the fight back coming into this next section. Longbow may well be coming under threat, but Deathstrike's car struggles a little bit through here. Uh, we've got way more Way more speed than both of the cars ahead of us, uh, but Speed Beast doesn't have the grip through here, uh, so we're kind of stuck fighting on weird alternate lines. And we fire it around the outside here, and then cut back on the exit is what we're going for. Got to be careful not to miss a checkpoint doing that. Uh, we cannot quite get it done yet. We'll have a little bit more time. We're well clear of six. I mean, there's a top five, a gap, and then six, I'm about to say that, top two are kind of a little bit further away, really. Um, if I can, I feel like if I can clear Speed Beast, me and Deathstrike aren't a million miles apart. I think Deathstrike's car is a little quicker here. Uh, we're quicker in, we're quicker in a really slow technical section. That's the one bit of the track where we are faster. Uh, and we're a little bit more composed through that part. In fact, Deathstrike's got to chase down the leaders. I think that's probably because they were fighting one another. It's here, the, I mean, this bit here I am quick, but I just... <laughs> oh, why would that not be cool? Why'd they replace that? And I've got to try and duck underneath Speed Beast for the exit, because it's the only place I'm going to get a pass to stick. But the stones being where they are means it's such a narrow line. It's so difficult to get that underneath, because if, if Speed Beast parks it, which they did very well there, uh, I've got no real option as to where I can go. Uh, yeah, if that's respawned. I don't know why I was hoping it was going to not have respawned, because, you know, very for the history has, you know, has taught me uh, is to expect the random bits of scenery to respawn and screw you over all the time. Uh, we're going to probably be too far back, I should think. Well, Speed Beast is wide through here. Again, we'll be flat through this. Speed Beast won't. Uh, what can I do here? So Speed Beast is going to defend there. I can't be aggressive on the inside through that section. You can poke the nose, but it won't matter. Although, oh, Speedy's gets a big slide mid-corner. Uh, Deathstrike's got in trouble and maybe missed a checkpoint. It's, it's going to be a battle for a podium spot. We've got to try and hold Speed Beast out wide. It's a drag race to the line. We know we're not as fast, but it might not matter. We might just get it in the end. Ooh. <laughs> It was only just. We get the Volvo, we get our Volvo onto the podium. <sighs> that's a great, that was a good race. <laughs> I'm slightly annoyed about the rocks, but that's just that circuit. It always does have those as a as a danger. Death Strike unlucky. Uh, that was quick. That vehicle was quick. Um, it would have been... I feel like I could maybe have got into the 56s if I didn't have anybody in front of me through the kind of hotel rocky section. Um, difficult to know. I think almost all of us are driving on the same compound as higher. 
Uh, <laughs> yep, <laughs> the off-road race. Um, but yeah, I'll take a podium. Happy enough with that. We head to the Mangrove Scramble for our next race. I am hoping... Oh, we're a long way back. I'm hoping we should be fairly good here. Uh, not going to have the straight line speed for some of the sections, but it do seem to have pretty good handling, so twisty bits we should be sorted, <laughs> basically. Uh, but we got a lot of a lot of work to do from 11th on the grid, honestly. I mean, if I can get a podium, I'll be doing well here. Um, just, just from the sheer sort of traffic I've got to try and get through, and knowing not only that, we know we're not great, or it's like we're not going to make a bunch of positions off the start line here, we know we're not great here. Um, we will see what we can do on this. Uh, we're going to pass one car, maybe, uh, down the straight, and then, yeah, we'll try and climb our way through. Someone has managed to miss a checkpoint. Uh, well, they're off to a good start there. I actually locked my brakes up. Oof, little, little too much on the old braking front through there. Never mind. We will survive that. Uh, we will hopefully grab a sixth place there. That's fine. Um, okay, it's uh, we're off to an alright start. Uh, this bit here kind of sucks for us. Can't do anything. Can't do anything about it. Uh, we'll try and stay out of the deeper water if we can. Uh, Speed Beast's vehicle, Speed Beast's car was good at that previous track. I think it's going to not enjoy life here. I don't know what tyres it's on. It's definitely a lot more power um, than the likes of my car. Uh, I'm not fighting. I don't have the, I don't quite have the composure to fight with the red car. Uh, that can go. It's going to get stuck in an awkward battle. But then we're going to get stuck in kind of similar place. We're going to try and duck underneath the Speed Beast who's struggling for grip. We might be able to sneak a move here as well on the red Volvo. Not quite. He's going to carry enough speed on the exit. We do pin it up high, but it's still got enough of a, enough of a run, enough momentum. But that is going to be gone. Yeah, I think Longbow and Deathstrike are already probably too far gone. Regardless, unless I've got crazy amounts of pace, which I simply don't have. Um, we're not bad. Like, we're not terrible. I think it's going to be maybe a fourth place. It is going to be our best day. Barring missed checkpoints, etc. We're still, I mean, we've still got cars to overtake. This is by no means a foregone conclusion here. But that is what I'm kind of going for in this one. Uh, unless we do suddenly find a whole heap of pace. Let's try and avoid the water as best we can. Uh, although that water there can sometimes be helpful a little bit in uh, oh, getting the car slowed down. Let's press the checkpoint, trying to. Uh, Say be sneaky, trying to make up any time I can on the car ahead. I hope that's not the corner I thought it was. Well, we're actually a little bit neater through here, so we should get... We're going to get fifth in the end. <laughs> I, I thought this was the corner that we were heading to. I was sort of slowing the car down more, but uh, we were actually on the more open turn. Uh, it kind of worked out in the end. It wasn't perfect. We did lose a little bit of time. But the car ahead got into more trouble than me, so in the end it all worked out. I thought I was missing that checkpoint, and that's why I kind of panicked and ended up stalling it. Ugh. Oh, wait. We... Uh, oh. Uh, red Machine has missed a checkpoint somewhere, uh, so Max is going to try and... He's going to have a recovery drive to go. That thing is so quick, it probably will catch anyway. Uh, we've got a fair bit of work if we want this podium spot. Uh, we've not had a very... That stalling out really didn't help. We've got very short, well, that's a very relatively short gears in this car. And yeah, got it wrong, got myself in trouble. Let's see if we can chase down a podium spot. Where are we fast? I mean, we should be fairly good on the more technical dirt stuff. That's probably where we're going to be at our up, utmost strength if I don't miss any checkpoints and the car ahead has got into trouble this lap around. We're only going to have. At best, we're going to have a lap, basically, to try and find a way past. And that's assuming that we catch by the end of this lap, which is easier said than done. We give it everything. We pull clear of fifth here. Uh, let's try and chuck it through here. Make up some time. Don't let the car stall out. Uh, we have we have gained. We have gained some of that time. Uh, take a slow, well, a slightly wider line. That's a bit wider than I was intending on. I didn't want to end up on the really tight line again, like I did last time. I'm just missing a checkpoint. I then overcompensated the wrong way. One more time around. We're not really there. We're certainly not going to be attacking into 
well, the first breaking zone, I guess it's turn two here. Uh, not going to be close enough to have a go, although I don't think it matters because I think that missing checkpoint anyway. <laughs> oh. oh dear. Well, we are not going to get to fight out that battle. I mean, it's whether I can hold off Max until the end. I mean, that car is clearly quicker than me. It's whether I've got a big enough margin. Unless I make any really silly mistakes, we should have a big enough margin that it won't be able to catch me. We'll have a clean lap to try and set a lap time. We haven't got the pace. Just get a gap, Death Strike, and Lombo are called there. We haven't quite got their pace around here. But, I, I mean, it is what it is. I do like this circuit, though, as far as uh, off road tracks go. I've enjoyed my Volvo. Can't really complain. Well, can't complain. The straight line speed is, is, the straight line speed is kind of killing it because it is not bad handling, but there are other cars that's completely wrong here. There are other cars that are handling as well as this and with more, more straight line speeds. So that's kind of what's screwing me a little bit. However, uh, we got it onto the podium. That is the bit that matters. Drove a relatively clean race, relatively out of trouble. Didn't really get the final lap showdown, unfortunately. Unlucky for uh, the vehicle that was in front of me missing a checkpoint. It is super easily done. Um, yeah, okay, we're not a million miles away from, from Death Strike's lap time. Uh, but, uh, yeah, we're a second down on, on Longbow. Didn't... I, I say wasn't the best race I've ever run, however, you know, a podium, podium is, is always good. We head into the final race on a very, very technical street circuit. We start from the pole, that's always nice. Uh, my car's been pretty good on the twisty stuff, we'll have traction out of the low speed acceleration zones, being all wheel drive, big, big tyres and all wheel drive. Uh, so this is probably not going to be a terrible circuit for me. Uh, it won't be the best circuit. I mean, if it was covered in dirt, it would probably be pretty good for me. Uh, I say that, though. I don't know. Again, if we can sneak onto the podium, that would be helpful. Death Strike might be stuck in traffic. Um, I'm expecting next to just bugger off. Um, kind of, un unless... Unless we manage to get a good start and we can defend. Okay, Max is doing the drive fall back and drive through the field. We might be able to defend from Longbow. It's going to depend on, uh, yeah, how good Longbow's car is in the really twisty stuff. Uh, mine did seem a little better at the first circuit, but uh, Longbow has already driven past us, so who knows how long that, how, yeah, how, that's, how it's all going to work out. Uh, we will find out very quickly. We are a little bit better under brakes down there, and we will retake the lead of this one. A lack of straight line speed, that's going to be a killer. I don't know if Longbow can see, maybe? No, I think so. There was, a, there was a weird little bit of a, like a laggy, oh, apparently that bit, oh, <laughs> we got evened out. I got street furniture on the inside. Longbow got street furniture on the outside. Um, I think we're going to fight this, and I just, we're going to just lose out to the straight line speed of that. We are a tiny, we're a tiny bit better in the really twisty stuff, but it's just not enough to overcome that straight line speed deficit. Uh, we're looking for a way back past again. We're, we're kind of just doing, we're just crisscrossing at the moment, me and Longbow. You know, you're tight for one part of the course, you then end up on a wide line for the next part. We're going to have a sneaky dive bomb there, but we're going to be slow on the exit. We're going to force Longbow to go a bit of an awkward way, but it isn't going to be enough. And I think we're going to lose out in the end here uh, to that car. Although, again, so some one corner we look slightly more composed, and then the next corner, Longbow's just that little bit better. We can just stay in the fight. If we can stay in the fight in such a way that forces Longbow to have to defend, that's important. If Longbow gets out of kind of attacking range, or oh, makes a mistake into turn one, that is not going to be out of attacking range now uh, because of that one. Can we do what we did last lap around and just kind of... Oh, okay, it's a little ambitious to fire the car up the inside there. we kind of got to go for it, though. We know we're good down here, but I don't want to end up on the bollard and we lean a little bit too much. But yeah, we're going to just get squeezed and... Ah, this just not got... I've not got the drive. 
just so annoying. <laughs> so annoying. I just cannot get off these corners. We, well, we can get going well enough. I just can't. I don't have the acceleration uh, to match that. We're nice enough around the final corner. Death Strike's fighting with Speed Beast and everyone else back there, so they're probably not going to catch us with the length of the race we've got here. Longbow will be wise to turn one. He's not going to want to make that mistake again. Uh, we are actually pretty good through here again. And we're going to do what we've been doing the last few laps. It's this change of direction. We can scythe past, but Longbow's going to want to fire it up the inside. Won't make it happen here. The thing is, almost doesn't need to, because we know how quick that car is. We're struggling to get the power down this time around. It's going to be more difficult for... That oh that Volvo oh god damn it I'm like I'm my own mistake through there uh, put ourselves all out of position okay there's a massive fight going on for third oh that's a great bit of driving by Longbow <laughs> I was expecting it to run a smidge wide and it didn't Longbow just parked it perfectly on the apex I couldn't find the cutback couldn't make it work uh, right can we do anything through turn one here Longbow is again wary of what we're going to try and do uh, I know what we're going to do here exactly the same as we've been doing all race, oh we launch it off the curb, we get a little wheelie in front of Longbow, this time around I cannot afford to run wide down here get on the power as early, in fact we can get on the power sooner if we wanted to uh, where is that car going to be, we're going to have to defend, ok we're better this time around we're going to have to probably defend in the final corner. We won't slide through there. Here comes the Longbow. Longbow might be too far back, you know. Uh, we can just park it on the apex. Don't do anything silly. It's a short run to the finish line. Longbow's looking. Won't be close enough. It came good for us in the end. <laughs> that was a bloody good fight. <laughs> that was a bloody good battle indeed. Ah. Oh. That, my car was good there. My car really worked there. Um... Yeah, Naxxis was a tad faster, although I think, to be fair, they were in a fight and I was in a fight as well. Um, but definitely, our car worked better at that track. Our car worked better around there. Oh. So, hey, we did get a victory in the Volvo, in, in, in the one-make Volvo race. I am, yeah, I am pleased with that. I, don't, I thought my car would be okay. I didn't think it was going to be that good there. Uh, once again... It just goes to show all I can build are handling cars, only this time I've put it on off-road race. I should have put slicks on this, really. As soon as everybody went oh, off-road race, I really should have gone slicks and just gone, gone all out. But uh, anyway, that is going to be it for this video. If you'd like to sign up and take part in the next one of these, you can via our Discord. There'll be a link to it in the description. Find the Versus Community sign-up section. You can register to take part in there. That, though, shall be it from me. Thank you all very much for watching. Until next time, a goodbye.